The tablet market just got a bit more crowded. Barnes & Noble is rolling out two new versions of its Nook tablet with sleek new hardware and sharper high-definition screens. The bookseller's move heightens the already intense tablet wars heading into the holiday season. Amazon.com recently announced four new varieties of its Kindle. Much of the success of any tablet will depend in part by the services associated with the device. Barnes & Noble is keen to that and has recently added a video purchase and rental service to its digital offerings. They never had a video service before, so that's mainly positioning them more against the Kindle Fire, which has a lot of movies, like 22 million movies. So it's a good step for them, but it, it's not putting them in the same ballpark as the iPad. As brick and mortar storefronts fade, the transition to digital will be essential for companies like Barnes & Noble. They're investing heavily in the Nook because people are buying less books, so they're trying to get into the ebook market. Um, they, they do make money on the Nook, so it's not, they're not selling it at a loss, but it's not like a high margin kind of item. They're not making a lot of money on the hardware. And the importance of the tablet market is growing. Forrester Research estimates that one-third of U.S. adults are expected to have tablets by 2016. The intense competition among manufacturers means those 112 million Americans will have plenty of options at their disposal. Mark Hamrick, The Associated Press.